The creaking timbers and gentle rolling waves of the shroud belie what lives beneath the surface. But you've faced the Leviathan many times, and it has grown weaker of late. Your companions should be able to handle it. Well, you hope at least. Hey, what's going on, everyone? It's Loki Oren. And we are back at it with uh, Chaos in Order as we get a... Uh... Can I just embark, please? <laughs> Good lord. There really needs to be, uh, like, spam them all for me, please, because this is a lot. We, we've successfully navigated to the point where our whole party likes each other. So, there's not much to say. But we definitely want to go after the Leviathan, if at all possible. If for no other reason, then I can. Alright, so, unfortunately... Okay, we do know where the lair is. We didn't get any other scouting. Oh, interesting. The, the only way to go to avoid... I mean, we don't care about avoiding the Watchtower. Yeah, we don't care about avoiding the Watchtower. So I think we just beeline for it. Because the Watchtower is also a speed buff. So... Oh, God. This really doesn't matter, so we'll just go straight. It, 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 it quite literally doesn't matter what we do. We have no way of knowing what's going on. Immediately losing a wheel. Not my favorite thing in the world. But, uh... We do have extra wheels, so that's good. Early field hospital is not bad, though we're not really in need of one. Yeah. She understands the futility of her work, but undertakes it nonetheless. Uh, restorative herbs is pretty good. We don't really need more healing salves. We don't really need the rest of this. We'll just buy them all. I mean, it's just... Restorative Herbs is just a very good thing to have in the, uh... In, a, in any boss fight. Like, just increased healing is always going to be good. And until we hit those Watchtowers, we can't see anything anyway. So, kinda, sorta, doesn't matter. Now, we could have avoided the Watchtowers uh, and gotten to the lair just fine. But, it again, we are going... This is our last zone before the mountain. Blueprint Tubes is useless to us. Good lord, that's another set of healing salves. We have, like, a million of them. We don't need that many healing salves. Fight, 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 fight! That was the wrong person. Alright. Fortunately, the Hellion goes first and cannot... hit the third rank. So we do get to swing out for free. And we do get to kill one that isn't taunted first. That's a good start. Um, well, may as well get the burn going. Briny spray seems kind of rude. I truthfully didn't even pay attention to all the relationships we had because we had so many of them. At some point, it's just like, look, a bunch of your skills are going to be good. There's no reason to really do anything. There we go. Taunt, no longer a thing. Howling End, though, very much a thing. Uh, stimulants? Yeah, stimulants. Let's, let's go bigger. There we go. Lots of burn. Make sure he hits Death's Door. Now, doing Make Way is a very rude thing for him to do. Particularly since Al Hazred is like kind of rotten at being in the front rank. However, nothing really to stall for, so we're just going to kind of do our thing here. And unfortunately, all of, uh, well, I guess Holy Lance is it is a, a upgraded or not upgraded, but um, relationship. But like most of his skills are not a relationship. Uh, Wolf's Blood Token can just go. Now, you know, Alhazred's at 12 between the Stagecoach and the buff. And we're only going to get faster. Because we are just going to hit double Watchtower. 
Which means El Hazard will always be triggering his uh, his thing. Ah, this is unfortunate. Well, 32 versus 30? Okay. Definitely like a crit token here. All right, so that's Death's door. He's got a burn on him. That's execute. I mean, take him to the howling end. A trifling matter. Very much a trifling matter. Thank you. Thank you, narrator. That was very, very much the accurate statement. Alright. So we just go watchtower, watchtower, lair. I guess we don't have to, because if this is really appealing, we could go to here or here instead, but like... Uh, oh, a free scout. We're about to get a scout anyway, so that's kind of funny. We don't really need any of the rest of this, though, and I'd rather not... I'd rather keep my flame up than down. Let's see what this does. Okay. Ooh! We missed the Kyurgen's table? An oasis right at the end is nice. Can we get... Ah, uh, we can't get to the Kyurgen's table. That's unfortunate. Memories of a dream... In a hoarder. What are we doing for money? We do have we do have a lot of baubles, so we could go to the hoarder and grab up a uh, grab up a little bit of cash. Or spend some cash. Alternatively we could go to this fight, but it actually doesn't net us any down loathing, so Man, our loathing has been running real high. Uh, I don't really want to go to the fight. I don't think the fight gets me anything, so I think we just go to the hoarder. Now at 13, uh... Now at 13 speed. Okay. Okay, Crusader Road Battle. Just some Spear Bruvs. That's okay. Who's got the... Does nobody get the taunts? Interesting. Interesting. Nobody gets the taunt tokens. Oh, Lee, these guys have 40 HP? What is this madness? As those are some tanky boys back there. Well. That's one barricade down. And we dodged the spear thrust. That's always nice. Jab. Get that, get that burn going. Seven to twelve. Eh, okay. A brilliant Dang! That was a big hit. Uh, Howling End? Uh, Howling End feels unnecessary. <laughs> the Hellion's just sitting there just... I'm just like cutting things in half. She's... She is a mad lady. She is very angry. I was saying 40 HP feels like a lot and then we're just like... Blasting through it. Which I guess makes sense. Uh, when you're getting as many crit, crit and strength tokens as the Hellion's getting, she uh, she kind of just kills stuff. She's kind of just... Ooh, adrenaline tonics, thunderclap grenades, alright. Well, find some use for that. Um, let's see. I think thunderclap grenades can be more useful than that stimulants at this point. Uh, adrenaline tonic will be more useful than a set of healing salves, and we'll call that good. Hit the hoarder, hit the lair, rock up this left side, knock down our loathing, hit the oasis, and uh, call that call that the zone. Alrighty. Nautical compass, rotten tomato. Ooh, rotten tomato is almost insane for this formation, but sadly, uh, she does. Freya does not spend a lot of time in rank two. 
She can get there. Seaman's boots is also tempting, but she's kind of set with what she's got. Leather strap, dead ringer. Mm. Not a lot of this stuff really doing it for me. Eh, dartboard's not bad. Buy the dartboard. Spend some money here. Deathcap spores is tempting, but I think we're good. Nautical compass is also tempting, but where would we put it? Like, the the only person who's really got any slots that are flexible right now is Magnus, and I actually kind of like what he's doing. Like, he's kind of got, he's got a vibe going on here. It's not a very exciting one, but it is a vibe. None of the rest of this is super exciting. Guess we'll just leave it it's okay this the seaman's boots is a a brief consideration if freya wasn't already rocking a pretty coherent plan uh she does move a fair bit or she can be moving a fair bit so that that's a consideration but in this case i think we just head into the lair and we do what we do when we face the lair which is smash everything Nice! Three stimulating poultices. That's exactly the drop we wanted to see. That sorts out all of our speed concerns. Oh! Oh my! Well, I mean, it's not my favorite, but that's actually... That, that could have been a much worse... Uh, that could have been a way worse ambush than it was. Instead, it did almost nothing. She can't move out of that spot, so she may as well stay there. We're actually kind of good with these guys being in the back ranks here. Fun fact, if a character is in stealth and they're the only living character, you can hit them. Little, uh, not often seen uh, mechanic. It doesn't, it doesn't come up very often, but uh, the game does not make you pass if there are no other viable options. Oh, wonderful. Wonderful. 22 HP. Is that going to be enough? No, it is not. Get out of here, you fishmonger. I don't got time for you. Let's pull you to the front where you're in range of the good stuff. A peppy hindrance. Nice. That was actually probably the least impactful of his available options. Do you think we howling end, even for a mineral, there is still quite a lot of the damages. Yep, 17 will do. I mean, that's not that's not really our favorite, is it? Uh, but he's dead, and there's not really anything to stall for. We'll do it with the demon's pull. That seems like a fun one to do. All problems have their solutions. What are we playing for? Uh, back and call is sort of useless. Bodkin, same story. Yeah, none of this is super exciting, but um, let's do it. Look at this big ugly thing. Right, crit token straight in. 32 versus 30. I think we just take the 30 so that we don't have the Hellion move out of position too early.
Who's getting targeted? Get Consecration of the Light running. Thunderclap grenade for the lulls. It did nothing, but it was it was a fun idea. Alright. Our two heaviest hitting characters are the ones in potentially getting grabbed. But I'm pretty sure that just puts the hand in range of being uh Ooh, it's tempting me. Cause this just kills. Yeah. The discipline thing there to do is kill the hand. Nice. I will not deny that the fun thing to do there is to use the crit token and iron swan it up, but you know, sometimes you got to make the disciplined play. The slow suffering begins. I mean, the slow suffering begins. I mean, there it's slow suffering. Maybe we are bodying this thing. Double crit token, you say. I think we continue to not need to Howling End here. I think we are getting plenty of damage done with what we are doing. Wow, 15. Nice. Now the hand comes up again, but uh, believe me, it's not going to matter. Because the Hellion goes first, hopefully. Nope, Hellion goes second, which is equally fine. Which actually means that the Hellion swings here. Keeps the hand from having a turn. And then, execution. And a two-point stress heal for our trouble. Very easy. Uh, that does nothing. That does nothing. Does nothing. Does nothing. Does nothing. Uh, we don't need all these griddles. We need one more. We don't need all these healing salves. Good lord. We are loaded up on loot. Um, would rather go to the... Rather go to the combat encounter, then the cultist encounter, and then the oasis. Ah! Tentacles. Okay, that was a lot of uh, calming incense. Alright, Alhazred, how are you doing with everybody? You need Freya. Freya, who do you need? You need everybody? You do need everybody. Wonderful. Boom! Once again, we are blessed with the uh, opportunity to get rid of the fishmonger before it has a turn. We uh, greatly enjoy this. Even better. Oh. Pleasant use of a thunderclap grenade there. Um, I'm not even gonna bother setting up our uh, consecrations here because we're just gonna we're just gonna rip these things apart. They're not gonna stand a chance. Yeah, we're uh, we're sort of firing on all cylinders here. There's really uh, not a lot left to be said. Think we're uh, think we're gonna be okay. We've got enough uh, we got enough good stuff happening. It says here you're a heretic. More mastery points, too, is nice. How are we doing for mastery points? We got another three. Yeah, sorry, sorry, boys and girls, but we are, uh, we're committed to this path. The avatars of oblivion. Clergy of the spreading stain. Oh, sup, bruh. It's the big boy. Uh, 
Uh, so he is protected by the warlord, you say. You are not protected by the warlord, though. Paddle. Get it going. The warlord, uh, the warlord is can be a scary fight, but it's not always. Get out of here. That actually did less than I was hoping it would. Precedo. Let's just get to chopping. The unfortunate thing is I don't know that any of the Warlord's rewards are that exciting for us. But I think we just, uh, we're just bashing now. Like, we kind of don't even care about the, uh, the weapon rack, because it's not doing anything. He does have a hundred, he is, he is ordained and has 108 HP, which is quite a lot. Let's put that in just because. Just kind of beating him down. It's, unfortunately, there's not a lot of strategy at this point. Like, there's no, there's not really a lot of combos for us to set up anymore. There's just, just beat this guy down. He's just a big old sack of HP at this point. Colophus. Double days. Not our favorite. But we do have the Burning Stars. And Jugement. That was a nasty Sakar, eh? Oh, wow. Death's door, not friendly. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Come on, game. What a crummy way to lose the run. What a crummy way to lose the run. First, first death blow check killed. Didn't even have a chance. What a crummy way to lose the run. Oh, that is lame. Get out of here. Jerk off. Oh, what did we win? We didn't even win anything worth having. Yeah, this isn't worth having. Tropium is not bad, but... Oh, that is so frustrating! That is so frustrating. Well, enlightening elements not really getting used. I don't think tropium's getting used. Eh, that can stay. Uh, very disappointed right now. In case this is not getting used. I'm only keeping these because we might we might pick up the highway man. And that would be the best item for him. Uh, jeez. Okay. Oh, that's very frustrating. And now we've got to now we've got to somehow limp to the end here with three characters. Oh, that is so unfair. Oh well, that's the game. That is the game.
scuffed around a chaos in order. And the funny thing is, it didn't even happen in like a, uh, like it wasn't like I got, I guess, did I get greedy? I don't think I got greedy. I didn't really like grab something that I shouldn't have. At least it didn't feel like I did. Like, maybe, I, I guess I could have healed her, but I wasn't expecting her to take that much damage in two hits. And then, you know, first first death blow check is just, I mean, that's just hard. Oh, well. All those healing items we have, and I never get to use them. Well, let's... Since the game has apparently decided to be like that, let's uh, let's go ahead and let it be like that. Do want to get you to the front here. Because I believe E now has Vanquisher. Get a Consecration ticking, I suppose. Disappointing. Do to do to do. A brilliant conclusion. Hopefully, we can limp our way to the end here because our, our formation really kind of depended on having the Hellion. Let's go just play a little bit more cautious now that the game has put me on notice that uh, it's prepared to screw with me. Face your confession, jerk. Nice. Dodging the crit blood command is always a good feeling. An opportunity. Squandered. Much rather get rid of her because the um much rather get rid of the evangelist because the cherubs just don't hit very hard. Neither of those items does anything. Oh, very disappointed. Unfortunately, this does mean this run no longer counts for my project. Uh, it will count as a completed Mark of the Chosen run, which is something. Uh, but, you know, we, we, have, we have progressed too far for me to shuffle this to another named formation. So, rest in peace, Hellion. Died, uh died to the random vagaries of this uh, this game that I uh, I do love even though it occasionally abuses me I haven't had a death like that in quite a while it's been a while since I've lost a run like that so it's not it's not the worst not the worst thing in the world and I definitely I definitely have been playing a little bit on the greedier side. Could just heal for 10. Heal himself. I think I'd rather the Vestal do the healing. Yeah. yeah. There's one down. Pull another one into range. Oh, that might that might just that does kill. Nice. 
straight into a very rude finishing blow. Man! Oh! Alright, she does need to skip here, unfortunately. Does have to pass. Nice. Okay, that, that definitely helps. Try to even out some of our HP here. See if we can't protect Al Hazra just a tad. We do need to just make her we just we do need to like win the fight here. Nice! Oh, that blind paying, paying, paying dividends. Measure out your violence and apply it to right, are you hitting Death Store this turn? You are not. You are, though, so. Yeah, I know you don't like it, uh, Magnus. I also know that I don't care. Oh, had the 50-50. Oh, we get to go twice. Wonderful. Uh, get out of here. Really? Wow. Okay. The game has decided to not screw me over twice. That's very kind of it. Jeez. What a uh, what a run. Let it die. Yeah. All right, hang on. Yeah, we got to I got to We have all these healing items which would have been real useful. Golly. Oh well. Is what it is. We'll run chaos. We'll run chaos in order back. Uh, stress heal supplies. I mean, let's do. Let's just do supplies. Don't really need the stress heal, and the supplies are a little bit more useful. Um, definitely don't need that bread. All right, this is the big one. This is going to be this is going to be quite difficult with three characters. Um, do we want She does have natural swing. Do we want to have her Hmm. I'm going to mix it up slightly. Wait, is this usable from... No, it's not usable. Okay, that doesn't help us either. Okay, there we go. I haven't played a lot with the melee Vestals. Once you unlock Seraph, like, the others just don't feel super impactful by comparison. So it's kind of just like, you know, you use the... You dance with the one that brung you kind of thing, and that one's just really bringing you. Okay. Probably should have ministrations on, but alas, we do not. Don't think we need to do that just yet. <coughs> Alter of resentment, fine. Double, yeah, okay. We are just gonna 
not run that risk. Patch. Bonk. All right, we are managing to avoid an exaltation, so that's, that's a good start here. The slow suffering begins. And straight into a... Jeez. Yeah, that's about right. Pacifist, you say? Ah, well, whatever. Um, that kills either way. Yeah, let's just get rid of you. Heal him with something else. Patch him up a little bit. Could Divine Comfort. Can't really Mace Bash here. Mace Bash does not reach where I need it to go, so we'll just do that. Good lord! Why? Okay. Well, that was interesting. That was quite the amorous. Sixty HP to get through, and we are falling behind on stuff. And unfortunately, we got these weak tokens. We still still hits for fourteen through all that week. Wow, that was quite a lot. Um, and dump the last of his healing salves into him. He's our most fragile character. God, we are spending so much res so many resources trying to keep this keep this going. Okay, I believe that is Holy Lance time. I think I got to gamble. We got we got to end this. We got to end this quickly. Of course. Nice. Big miss. Because that means bonk straight to horny jail. Zealous accusation. Burn dead. Wonderful. Okay. And you know what? Bonk. Mace Bash getting it done. Even the greatest of I'm very glad that I did that. Spoken. None of this. This isn't getting used. Okay, fine. Oh, okay. That's the end of. That's the end of this zone. Unfortunately, Chaos and Order will have to ride again. Losing the Hellion to uh, what I think was probably a bit of nonsense, but, you know. That's how the game goes. I hope you all enjoyed it. Thank you all for watching. We do get we do get some extra candles and in mastery points for bringing the Hellion's corpse to the inn. The place is a little worse for wear, but familiar nonetheless. Rest in peace, uh, Freya. You had a pretty long run, and uh, alas, it ends here. Onward. All right. Who do we want? Um. Could just random it, but I actually kind of just want to win this run quickly. Let's bring the we'll bring Clive, the highwayman. Your coach must be maintained if it is to carry you where you must go. Mostly because Clive is a very upgraded highwayman. He's got quite the. Uh, he does have smallpox, though. Forgot he has smallpox. That is unfortunate. And we don't have bucket of leeches or anything to fix that. Oh, ah, well. Oh, well. That's okay. Buy that. Buy that. Buy that. Yeah, first of all, pig.
Um, Alhazred, you are 12 now? Clive. Clive. Alhazred. Because I believe it is just the two of you. Yeah. Um, it's just go fast, right? It, whereas being first... Yeah, so both of you are good. So, Alhazred, we'll, we'll just let him go first. We were so set for this. We were so dang ready. Very frustrated. Oh, well. Just kind of... Just kind of quickly spamming them out, because it sort of doesn't... It's not that it doesn't matter, but, like, that's, that isn't what we're doing. Oh, we do need to swap this. Um, Mastery Trainer. Um, Battle Heal. Yes, please. Uh, Holy Lance. I don't think we need it. I think we're good. I think he's got what he needs. Uh, Clive. Change Path. Um, sharp Shot. Or Rogue. Uh, I think we'll go... Probably just go rogue. Yeah, because that lets that's lets Aridia set back up to where she kind of wants to be. Yeah, okay. Change path to rogue. We still want pistol shot. We don't really want grape shot blast. We well, actually, I guess we can. Uh, let's see. Pistol shot for sure. Duelist advance. Why not? Oh, wait. All right, let me just... I, I need to pause for a second and, like, actually think about what I'm doing here. All right. Let me get let me get Clive's skills set back up. All right, what do we what do we need? We are rogue. We could slice, dual advance, grape shot blast, take aim. We could slice and dual advance for sure. Pistol shot. Um, and maybe I should have gone sharp shot. Well, extra combo is never going to feel bad. Something like that, maybe? Because I don't think we're going to be taking aim much, but we are going to be doing the rest of this. Yeah, this feels decent. Yeah, this feels good. All right, uh, that'll do. All right, Clive. Um, Wicked Slice. Duelist Advance doesn't really need the upgrade. It does. It does its thing without help. So we do something like uh, do something like that. All right, cool. Another another thing of that. Oh, we don't need the whittling tools, but I bought them, so call that good. A little wasteful, but I don't think it's going to matter here. A sound investment in roads yet untraveled. May as well just pop that up because there's no reason not to. Master points are done. This is good. Okay. In items. Uh, let's do you. Don't need that. Uh, we can have that. All right. Whew. That's still still a little torn up about that hellion, but we will uh, we will have to live with it. So Clive the Highwayman joining at the last moment just to uh, kind of bring the uh, bring the hammer down here. Oh, that's probably what I should check. Do we have any milk soaked linen for sale? No. Okay. It'll have to do. All right. Thank you all for watching. Uh, this won't be a finishing for Chaos and Order, but it will be a uh, 
a run to finish. So uh, till next time, see ya.